In this video, I am going to discuss about central banks. Central Bank, Federal Reserve, Monetary Authority, Reserve Bank is the bank for both banks and for government in the country. These are the different terms or names used to call central banks. Federal Reserve used in USA. Almost all the other countries in the world use the central bank term. This is an independent entity from the government of the country. Very important thing to note that the government of the country and the central bank of the country are two different entities. And usually the central bank has to be an independent entity. Monetary policy of the country is controlled by the central bank which is to control the money circulation in the economy. We discussed about this under monetary policy. Central bank is the entity in an economy which controls the interest rates. If the interest rates go up, the money circulation in the economy will go down. And if the interest rates go down, the money circulation in the economy will go up. This controlled by the central bank. Government of the country borrow money from the central bank. The central bank of the country is the bank for government and also the bank for other banks. The central bank plays a critical role in formulating and implementing monetary policy to achieve macroeconomic objectives such as price stability, full employment and sustainable economic growth. Let's talk about the functions of a central bank. Monetary policy. The central bank is responsible for formulating and implementing monetary policy which involves controlling the supply of money in the economy to achieve macroeconomic objectives such as price stability, full employment and sustainable economic growth. Banker to the government. The central bank acts as the government's banker and advisor on financial matters. It manages the government's accounts, issues government debt and provides loans to the government when necessary. Bankers to bank or lenders of last resort. This term is very important. Lender of the last resort. The central bank also serves as a lender of last resort to commercial banks, providing them with liquidity during times of financial stress. This means commercial banks can borrow money from the central bank in an emergency situation. That is why this is called the lender of the last resort. Issuing and regulating currency. The central bank is responsible for issuing and regulating the country's currency, ensuring that there is enough cash in circulation to meet the needs of the economy. Money printing is also done by the central bank. This is also called the quantitative easing. Managing foreign exchange reserves. The central bank manages the country's foreign exchange reserves, which are used to support the value of the currency, to intervene in foreign exchange markets, and to settle international transactions. Supervising and regulating banks. The central bank supervises and regulates commercial banks and other financial institutions to ensure their safety and soundness protect depositors' funds and maintain the stability of the financial system, conducting economic research and analysis. The central bank conducts research and analysis on economic trends, financial markets and other factors that affect the economy. It uses this information to make informed decisions about monetary policy and to provide advice to the government and other policymakers. Central bank is the main authority that calculates the customer price index. 
which calculates the inflation. We discussed about this before. Very important thing to note that central bank and the government are two different entities. Government control the fiscal policy, which is the taxation. Central bank controls the monetary policy, which is interest rates. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.